Okay, so we're standing in near the William DeWitt gravestone, and I'll read his plaque to you. Um, if you look up a bit, you'll see the Confederate flag. It says Confederate War Veteran, William DeWitt, Virginia, uh, Company B of the Most B Regiment of Virginia Cavalry, Confederate States Army, on July 12, 1846 to September 30th, 1870. All right, so instead of fighting for the Northern forces, he decided to fight for the Confederate forces. It's hard to uh, understand why the DeWitt family was part of um, Granby culture already. Okay, and what we're going to do is show you up here the stone. Okay, we're going to raise it up and see this stone. It says the first name, Colonel Benjamin DeWitt. 1793 to 1855, and then his wife below it, and then it has other people in the family. So they were established for a long time in Granby, and yet the son decided to go fight for Mosby Rangers, right, which was basically a cavalry group. And it was based in Maryland and Virginia, and then in Virginia only because Maryland was not allowed to join the Confederate States. And so why would him make the decision? Did he agree with the Confederate way of life? Did he agree of having that slavery should still exist? You know, you don't know. Either group would have paid him the same amount of money, so I guess it was a philosophical decision. But it might be true that every every Protestant cemetery in Massachusetts that was, was around the 1800s probably has at least one Confederate soldier inside of it, right? And I know in Holyoke we do, in South Hadley we do, in Granby you have this one. I'm sure other towns will have that one, right? And it's for many different reasons. The one in South Hadley is because when he came from Ireland, he first went to North Carolina in the late 1850s. He lived with his brother. I won't tell you his name, but he was still there when the war broke out, and so he fought with the Confederates. And then later, during the war, he moved up north, right? So he gave up on that. So there could be so many reasons. So don't be discouraged that this Confederate flag up here. It's not to be shameful to anyone. It's just respect them as a foot soldier in, in a war that America had to fight. Thank you very much.